<laughs> Jay Paul, where you at, Jay Paul? Where you at, Jay Paul? Uh oh, do I hear a, 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 uh, what do you call it? He calling you out, Jake Paul. y'all how y'all doing i hope everybody's doing well and healthy i hope your families and your households are thriving um we are in a transition right like now and yes like and subscribe as you heard nick say we have had so much going on guys and we are documenting everything when i say we're documenting everything we're documenting everything okay, this how you this how you box <laughs> Jay Paul, where you at, Jay Paul? Where you at, Jay Paul? Uh oh, do I hear a, 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 a what do you call it? Uh, he calling you out, Jake Paul. What's yeah, check up? out my kicks. These are kicks for today. Check out my kicks. Yeah. I have these shoes too. They bands. Yeah. Nick bought me those. Actually, at first, when I first saw them, I was like, eh. But they turned out to be one of my favorite shoes. Has that ever happened to you guys? Where you, like, get stuff there? Did Nick cut his hair? He did. What you guys think about Nick's hair? Yeah. Let us know below if you like his hair short or longer. That's right. I have a new hairstyle, too. Look, we all do. We like to do things different and switch up. You never know who you're going to get. That's how you keep it spicy and fresh. Yeah, that's how you Why you put a muffin on my head? Yeah. Muffin. You guys know he calls me muffin. I don't even think we I don't even think we told you guys that that yeah. he that he calls me muffin. He got stuff in your hair. <laughs> Nick, Big Nick has been calling me muffin that's since before I'm this was like what for 13 years now. For 13 years now I've been muffin. According sure. to Nick and his family, everyone has been calling me muffin since from before I can remember. Okay, so we actually met. Well, we can do it real quick. We actually, this is the condensed short version. We Ooh. actually met at a church. I was working there for the summer as a teacher, um, teaching the young while I was in college. And I had just started college actually. And Big Nick was working there as just part of the staff. And he saw me. I think he saw me first, he said. Did you? Did you no, see me I first? see. Yeah, I saw you first in there. You were just getting hired. Yeah, I was just getting hired. It was my first day, and I saw someone staring at me, and I'm like, oh, like we stare pretty hard. But you know, I'm thinking, okay, you know, I'm sure we'll talk at some point. It was my first day, so I wasn't really, you know, focused on that. So I'm like, walk. I walk past him, and so I spoke to him because he was like staring at me all hard. So I'm like, hey, how you doing? You know, as I walk past. And so he always uses that talk about I approached you first. Nah, bruh, I ain't approached you first. No, I didn't. The only thing I like is he sit like an old man. Look how big Nick sits. What you talking about? <laughs> Who sits like that? You too young to be sitting like that. But anyway, so when I saw him, I'm like, oh, okay, you know, he's a nice looking guy. But nice looking, that's it? Yeah, but on, like man. his eyes was like this, like looking like this. So I'm like, I knew he was going to, you know, try to suck to me. So I, 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 so, am I a high value man? Am I a high value man? Yep. <laughs> so <laughs> right, at man. the time you weren't. And that's something I want to talk to you guys about too. I, I want to have you man. About like these lists that women have nowadays. Like I understand like at this point, you know, I guess it depends on how old you are, but, or how young you are. But I know that when, but I don't want to get off track, but that's what, something we're going to talk about. In the next video of you know what you should expect Good morning, from a man dude. you know when you meet a man and you know because a lot of people turn down men they're like oh he doesn't have this he doesn't have that but I had all that, didn't I? Nick didn't have all of what he has now when we first met you know we work together to build and get everything that we have acquired and all of our assets so uh, but we were very young. Like, I was super young when we met. I was only 20 years old. So, hey guys, I wasn't down, looking no, for... No, I didn't have below. to have the whole... Look, comment down below. Money package. Comment down below. At that time. Listen. Now, it's a little different. You know, we're older. If you're looking for someone now, I can understand you. But, yeah. So, back to the subject at hand. So, when we actually first met, I did end up speaking to him first. Because, you know how if someone's staring at you really hard... You know, you're going to speak. You're going to say hi. You know, that's like the normal thing. And, you know, smile or whatever. 
um, <laughs> if you want to, if you feel like it. So, you need to smile. That's what they've been talking about. That's the subject. Yeah, that's another mind. subject. Like, do you get mad as a lady, ladies out there? Do you get, like, irritated if a guy tells you to smile? I mean, there was someone who got irritated because of that. I'm like, I don't know. I think sometimes we, we, maybe we're going through things you know, you and like people get upset. Work. But I'm like, that's, if that's the worst thing that happened to you today. Somebody tell you to smile and you should, you had a good day. But anyway, especially with everything going on right now in the world, and I can, I'll come sit on the couch with you. So, when I was passing him, you know, he, you know, I spoke, I said, how you doing? And I went over there, I went over to do my work. And so, as I'm like lifting up the boxes with all the books in them, you know, Nick walked over there and he was like, um, excuse me, you need some help with those boxes? And I was like... No, I'm good. You know, because I didn't want to seem like I'm fast. Well, I'm at the church. You know, I'm working. It's my first day. So, I was like, I'm thinking, okay, I'll see him again. He works here. So, I'll see him again tomorrow on the day after. And then, you know, maybe we can talk after that. So, he was like, no, I think you, excuse me, I think you need some help with those boxes. That's right. That's right. And I'm like, uh, okay, you know, he came like with a little aggression or whatever. So, I'm like, okay, like he's a man who knows what he wants. So, when he said that, my other friend at the time was there, and she was like, wait a minute, hold on. You didn't ask me, did I need any help with my boxes? <laughs> and then Nick looked over to her and said, well, hers look a little heavier than yours. It did. It did. <laughs> so, at that point, like, I'm like, okay, he's funny. Like, he's assertive. He knows what he wants. And so, like, you know, that was attractive to me. So, I was like, okay, I'll give him a shot. And, I mean, you he was me fine. Thank you, babe. He was handsome. He looked good. So, I wasn't a high value then? To you, you don't think back so? then? No, he was not what? high value. No, he we were we were in our twenties, and he wasn't high value at all. And so we worked wah, our way wah, up there. Wah. So I feel like if I would have been like waiting around or like looking for like really zoomed in and focused on a high value man at that time, um, it would be harder for me to be you know actually in a good relationship or find a good relationship, you know. So, but then again, we were 20, so. I, I, I said, stop running. They running around like crazy up there. The life of having. Three boys. The life of having three little boys. So what do you think? So how do you feel like we met? And then that first, that actually that first day is when he asked me, like he called me like soon after we got off work, maybe a few hours, a couple hours. And what I said? I was at my friend's house and I was just telling her, I was like, I met this guy. He's really handsome. He's good looking. And she was like, oh, really? Does he have any brothers or whatever? And I was like, I don't know. And then right as I was talking to her, Nick called me. So I'm like, oh, this is him. He called me right now. And I'm like, hey, what's up? That's right. And he's like, come on. You don't, you don't want to come out with me? Want to go on a date? And I'm like, wait, right now. I'm like, right now? I'm like, I haven't even been able to go get home I went yet. out. I cashed her out. He came and got me. No, he didn't cash me out. But he did <laughs> come pull up in his brand new car. And I was like impressed because, you know. I just turned 20 and all, all the guys didn't have new cars back then. So, you know, I was geeked and I was kind of wondering if he was going to be kind of square. Just because what? they were telling me that. On, because my friend was like, well, you know, he's the pastor's, uh, not saying that PK's, you know what I'm saying. You know, so, so I didn't know if he was going to be real stiff and real like, whoo, hallelujah all the time. You know, when you're trying to be on a date, I just didn't know. <laughs> So, no, my grandfather was a bishop. My right. dad was an elder. Yes. So I got the church background in me. You do. But I got that thug in me too, though. <laughs> 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 but yeah, so, and that, that was the thing. That was something that I liked about him too, is that there was a balance. So he was grounded in, you know, in spirituality and God and he knew like he had a godly conscience and I did like that but he also you know was smooth he had a swag and he just thank was you, like thank you, thank you know you. like he had like the package you know the basic package at the time the basic yeah the basic package is what you need oh no, I got the platinum like package I got then the platinum he, package he gained and got you know his career going the money going entrepreneurship after that yeah and so it, it did all come together. So what what's your version? Because he has a totally different version than me of how we met. What's your version of how we met? 
It's basically on the lines of what she said, but the difference is she came to me first and was like, I came. Yeah, to I was first. working. I was working, and I saw her in the office. I'm like, man, she bad, man. Who is that? So that's when my boy was like, man, she knew, you know, blah blah blah. So when she came out the office. She looked, saw it was there. It was more than one guy, and it was like four different guys. She could have walked like anywhere else in the in the in the room. She came down my aisle, my aisle. So what's, what what what's that letting you know? She came down my. Aisle. So when she came down my aisle, she came to the end, just looked at me dead in the face. So I looked back at her, and she was like, "How you doing?" And I was like, "No, no, no. Yeah, you did. You said how you you said she said how you doing?" Uh -huh. And that's when I was like, "How you doing?" So once she spoke to me like that and gave me that look, I'm like, I think she want me to grocery bag her, basically. So you know, I went over <laughs> over there. You know, what's that mean, grocery bag? Good boy, bye. You know what that means. So I went on over there. You know, I asked for a number. She rejected me. I liked that when that rejection. I liked it. So you know, I <laughs> went back. Okay. I went back. I you know, I customized my my you know my approach again. I came back. She rejected me again. I'm like, okay. <laughs> I didn't it reject was, you. It was I was cute telling at first. You not now it's starting to get irritating. <laughs> so I was getting ready to leave the third time. So then I came back the third time. I was like, look, I'm about to go. You ain't going to see me again. So I want your number. And she was like, I just got hired. I'm like, I don't care. So she was like, uh, you got a pencil. I'm like, no. Nah. So she grabbed the pencil. Back then, we was using pencils. Like, right. <laughs> but we that still, just goes to how long ago though. that was. It was still in school. It wasn't that long ago. Uh, it was an 07, but I'm just saying, but then she, we wrote, had she, cell phones, she wrote her but... number down and everything, and yeah. I hit her up later that day. She went out with me. We went down to the water, chilled, talked, got to know each other, and then her mind was blown ever since. I mean, her mind was blown. Look at her now. She's just smiling now. Yeah. Years later. Just, yeah, okay. You know, my mind blown. You know, then I leveled up on, like... I, yeah, my I leveled up on my money and career and everything, and you know. So, you know, that's, that's all where I'm at wrote. now. Yeah, and the kids is here and everything. It's just crazy. Coming up. So, so next, I would love, I think, you know, we should do something. What do you think about talking about what you do um, for a living? What you do in a daily basis? Yeah, I'm thinking about money, doing a day in the life. So you, you want me to explain how I make my money? Sure. How you make your money? That's on the next video. <laughs> that's coming it's coming i'm not sure exactly in what order but it's coming we're going to talk about what we do our careers mm. um our goals i don't say how much i make i ain't letting the irs leave me alone yeah that's not necessary but well, we'll say what we do though but we will talk about what we do but i love i like doing it i love making videos and um there's so much more we want to share with you all we want to bond with you all. We want to connect with you all. And, you know, I think that posting more vlogs so will really do that. Other things. Going I am. Y'all want to come with me to, to New Orleans, to New Orleans? I could go, but I'm going. I didn't have a babysitter, so I got to stay here. Yeah, that's the tough part. Like, we don't just leave our kids with anyone. And if the few babysitters that we use are unavailable, then we just are out of luck. Um, but, I've hey, Shawty. I've been I in New Orleans love, already before. Anyway. I love New Orleans. And I'm just ready. You know how sometimes you need a break. I'm going for my cousin's birthday. Um, you know, one of my best cousins. You know, we're the same age. We grew up together. She's like a sister to me because I don't have any natural sisters. Um, and so it's going to be exciting. Like, I'm just looking forward to it because I'm like, I got to get out this house. Like, I'm going to start crazy you up that. in Everywhere here. Everywhere she goes, she says she's going And, crazy. you know, being, you know, all the different hats that we wear as women, sometimes it could just, you know, it could just wear on you you know so i've been hat? studying I don't wear no hats. um i've been uh working as from from home on our business i've been working on these youtube videos and i've been you know with the kids and stuff and just the whole household everything it's just, it can be a lot sometimes and you know what i think this is going to be good for me and just for my mental we're going to get massages we're going to have spa days we are going to just do what women do but anyways we're not going to talk you guys to death we just wanted to come to you all and let you know a few things, just like how we met and everything. And our love story, you know, our love story, I would say, is one of strength, endurance, um, longevity. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we've been through a lot of things. Like, we didn't just pop up and, you know, have, like, everything that we have today as far as, like, our family and hey, our Nick. sons and our 
and the qualities that we have in our marriage today haven't always been like we had to grow yeah, we, into we, that. We had to grow into it. And yeah, so I mean, I just want to encourage anyone who's married right now, um, who may be going through it, um, and you're wondering, you know, hey, can we continue this? You know, pray about it, stay prayerful, talk to God about it. And, um, you know, let let God and your inner voice guide you on, you know, everything and what to do and just lean on him. Because, you know, that's the only way, honestly, that we were able to even make it through thus far. So that's our, you know, general love story. And we're going to go deeper into it and, you know, get down to some things and even like issues that we go through as a married couple. If you'd like to share anything down in the comments like your about your marriage. Fine. Thank you. Appreciate it. This is one of my favorite styles. Well, I have to get ready to go to work, yeah. make some more money. I'm going to talk about what I do next time. Mm -hmm. And you could do it too. Do what too? Whatever I do, it can be done. <laughs> we don't know yet. You haven't told anybody. I know, but I'm giving you. He like Tommy. Time. Are you like Tommy? You know how Tommy on Martin. You ain't got no job, Tommy. We never Tommy. knew what he did. <laughs> I'm going to let you know on the next video. He work all the time, y'all. He's always working. Always. That's why, you know, sometimes we have, mm. you know, that's yeah, one of our issues. stay home, but how about you men cannot stay home? You know how you just get tired when you're doing everything at home all the time? Like, it can be overwhelming because he is gone all the time because he, got, he need to pull his shirt up. I know. He got on my shirt. He has on his dad's shirt, guys. Look, he got on his dad's shirt. Look how big I it is. I guess it makes him feel closer to his dad. <laughs> Say hey, hey Stack fam. Hey. Oh, we, we don't have a name for our uh, subscribers. We need to come up with a name for our subscribers. Comment down below what our subscribers' names should be. Right. What y'all? What should we come up with? Let us know. Comment down below. Anyway... Love you guys. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. We appreciate you. Team we love Stacks. you. Team Stacks fam. Yeah, I like Team Stacks fam. What do you think? Team Stacks fam. Did that sound sweet? Yep. Comment down below. Yeah. So make sure you subscribe if you haven't. You better push the button. <laughs>